Hey everybody, how's it going? I'm Seth and welcome back to another video, folks. This is going to be a quick video. I'm going to show you the location of where you can find Praxis the Bastard. And of course, this guy is a boss. He doesn't always spawn there, but I'm going to show you the location. Now, you have seen me play in this area in a previous episode. Uh, and as I said, he doesn't always spawn there. But you can also get um thralls that are tier three thralls there as well so named thralls so i'm going to show you how to get to the location first things first let's show you where i am so uh this is the entire map of the isle of sipta so as you can see right here on the map this is where i'm located right here so if we zoom in a little bit you can see you can kind of come this way and basically the way the path goes is sort of like this so this right here is where we want to be right there in the end and so this is Sipta's ascension uh this is bastard sand and of course Sipta's uh contemplation so we want to basically pass the bridge and then we work our way all the way around it so basically this is the path that it goes and basically we'll end up somewhere there it can be a bit challenging to get to um you know, you're gonna have to fight all of these guys uh, they're not that difficult, but as you make your way past this bridge, uh, I think I'm going to call it bridge, just out of lack of better words, uh, we then basically need to go around. This is a good place to find some priests as well. Uh, I don't know how often they do spawn high-level priests, but it's definitely a place to look. So as you make your way around, you can see there are some chests around, and it's probably best that you take the left path just because... Um, it is easier to get up. So basically right here if we go around I'll show you exactly what goes on here um, There's this little bridge thing that's kind of broken. So it is a bit challenging. You can climb up that way if you want to but I think Just for purposes of keeping things simple. You can actually climb up this way. Uh, there aren't any obstacles as such to Actually contend with now this area can spawn named thrall so it's definitely a good place to come and check out if you're after named thralls it is actually quite a neat location to be honest and uh, here we are we have Craxus the bastard now of course this guy is a bit of a boss and uh, you can come from the top or from the bottom it is up to you I'm going to show you what this guy drops uh, he does drop a good headpiece so it is of course heavy armor so this is the helm of Craxus as you can see, it's legendary, it's heavy, armor, and bonus survival is what we get for it. And let's replace this with what I already have. So let's check it out. And as you can see, it doesn't look half bad, to be honest. And uh, the armor on it is actually quite decent as well. Obviously, I prefer what I already have, just for look purposes. We also get the short sword of Prince Craxus. Again, legendary, it's a weapon. It's definitely worth picking up. Uh, I would probably use it on thralls. And of course, we also get the mace of Prince Craxus. It's, uh, as you can see, damage wise, they're not really that great. Nothing special. And Pike of Prince Craxus. And uh, yeah, they are all legendary items. They have a decent amount of durability. And um, like I said, he doesn't always spawn here. You can get all sorts of NPCs. You can also get um, named thralls here so this is definitely a good location to come and look for named thralls i will be having a look around here from time to time just to make sure uh well i want to get some named thralls from here at least for me for my personal gameplay so yeah that is pretty much it he's just happy sat here that is it for this video folks um, just kind of keep it sweet and short. I do hope that you have found this useful and informative. If you have, please do not forget to support me and the channel by hitting that like button, subscribe, and comment for more. And if you want me to do more stuff like this with regards to Conan Exiles, I am more than happy to do so. Uh, I have covered most of every single content or almost all the content that there is with regards to the game. Until next time, stay safe, folks.